Hey guys, this is Andy. I'm here bringing you another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue 2. Okay, in the last episode we finished the first half of Frosty Forest, and now we're heading on to the next part, which is Frosty Grotto, I think. Yeah, Frosty Grotto. I, I don't know, I think this dungeon, or this part of the dungeon is like three floors as it always is. So it's not going to be that hard or that entirely big to do, so... Let's go ahead and get on with this shit. Oh god damn it, really? Oh fuck. Have I really gotta say oh fuck. Okay, move out of my way and then I'm gonna go try and find you. Oh you're being attacked, dude. By two of these guys. Well, almost being attacked by two of those guys, and that's not what we want, so we're gonna get rid of them. Because fuck these guys. Yeah, fuck him right up the asshole. I think I don't know what. Um, oh, it doesn't have any effect on you guys. Seriously? No, that's not cool. No. Yes. Right. Okay. No, it did it again. Right. Okay. I'm just gonna go up through there, and I think I'm. Well, no, I'm not near the stairs yet. I can't see the. It's camouflaged on my screen again. I can't see the friggin' map, so I don't know where the where the fuck I'm going. I'm just gonna go straight up here because I can. Because I can, like a boss. I don't know. Oh right, it's a ride on. Oh no, not a ride on. Ride horn. Oh, these guys aren't that powerful. We can just dig on you because I know that's super effective. No, these guys are all rock type. Fuck. Why well, we got rock type Pokemon in our frost dungeon? That makes no sense to me whatsoever. And also I think ice is super effective on these guys, so I don't understand why the fuck a ride a Rhyhorn is in a dungeon like this. That's really weird. You wouldn't see that in a Pokemon game. Well not normally. I well I wouldn't expect to see like see a rye horn in a friggin ice dungeon there you go that's oh yeah I forgot what the fuck had no eff why does it say it had no effect on rye horn when the fuck it's not even a rye horn it's a metan okay that makes zero sense and here's the stairs finally I found you alright let's go upstairs Let's go upstairs and eat cookies and get drunk on milk because milk is alcoholic beverage. Milk is a al uh, alcoholic beverage. Well, it sure enough is in the land of Hyrule. Oh god, ah, oh, fuck. Well, I guess that's what it is, because they always have milk bar, and the bar is where you buy alcohol. And I guess that's where a lot of people get that idea that um, that milk in Zelda is alcohol. <laughs> uh, no, I don't. Oh my god, I fuck, I didn't press up. I hate this game, I swear it hates me too. Oh god, I'm being raped by two of these guys, so I'm just gonna just dig, just get rid of them quickly. I mean, dig is gonna, dig's gonna be, not gonna be so useful against the boss, so it's okay to use it. I mean, I, pl I have plenty of max elixirs anyway, so it doesn't really matter what I use, or what I don't use. So let's just go ahead and keep doing dig on you. Dig. Wow, I still haven't found these stairs. Why, right, hey, 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 don't do that. Not cool. Well, Ember seems to do the job. Uh, but Ember does do more damage than what Confusion does. Hmm. Well, yeah, I guess it's ground, and when fire hits the ground, it kind of heats it up. Uh, I guess that's the idea they were going for there. Ow. 
bitch. Don't use that shit on me. Mm. I have rest anyway, so it doesn't matter. I think this is the final floor. Oh, that's not. There's more? There's more? Are you telling me there's more to this place? Oh, well, there's only two enemies in the forest grotto anyway. It's just those guys, the fucking metans and the stupid Rhyhorn bitches. Oh, what the hell, man? Seriously? I just dig for nothing. Are you kidding me? You are kidding me, right? Let's proceed onwards. Oh, there's more. Oh, right, okay. I guess there's like five more floors. I don't know. Maybe there's five. Hopefully there is. I don't want to be going for another whole bloody long dungeon in this episode. I just kind of wanted to do this and fight the boss and then end it. Uh, I think this is the last floor. Yes, it is. Right, okay. I was hoping it was. We should have traveled far into this forest. I think we'll be out if we can get through this part. It shouldn't be far. Let's keep going. Huh? Lewis? Did you just say something? I didn't think so. I thought I heard a voice. I must have imagined it. Yeah, it's your imagination. You're thinking too much about turkeys talking all the time. You... Yeah. <laughs> you might... You may not pass. We may not pass? You shall not pass! Who's there? You are forbidden to pass. If you persist in trying to pass. Is this Gandalf or something? <laughs> then so be it. But only after you have defeated me. Def Ow, oh, it's too bright. The ice around us is reflecting this light. Gah! Oh, it's Articuno. I am Articuno, the water of ice. Those that enter the forest I shall destroy with all my might. Let's, let us be. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, bring it on, bitch! I, I can take you all on. You motherfucking ass head from hell. Prepare to die. Wow. I did quite good damage, actually. He's confused! That's good. That's good. That's what we want. Confusion. Yeah, right, okay, now we're getting into it. Okay, we want Charmander to use... Oh, damn! Oh, damn! Okay, guys, I'm going to meet you back here again. <laughs> yes, I'll see you guys then. It is possible to beat this boss at the level we are at, but I'm going to try and do this now. If I can, I don't know, but I know it is possible. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the Norenberry because I can <laughs> eat it. Yeah, you use Ember. Whoa, what? Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me at the arse? I was... Uh, I want to try and get it so then I don't, like, ha Yeah, like that. That's how I want it this fight to go, I just want it to go like this and I don't want him to use some crappy m move that kills us instantly so I'm going to use another Ornberry I'm going to use another Ornberry on fight for uh, yeah Uh, he died. He died before I could even give it to him. Yeah, don't worry, I'm beating this bitch, so it doesn't matter, because I, I seriously couldn't give a shit. You are going down, you stupid motherfucker. I want to know how... No, it's not that button. Like... No, it's not that button either. You just keep. Oh yeah, you're right. Okay.
Wait, I'm trying to do this. Um. No. Fuck. No. Uh. It, it just goes off. It's See, I didn't want to do that. What I wanted to do, I wanted to throw it to him, but it won't let me. It's been retarded. Fuck's sake. I'm just going to keep using Dig now. And let him use Ember all the time. Okay, you use Rage if you want to, but... Oh, come on, how did that miss? Ah, oh, you dead, sucker! You ain't beating me, bitch! Ice bird of shit, you are. Ah, finally. Please, Articuno. We have to get through it no matter what it takes. Please let us pass. No, I cannot allow your passage. Why? Why can't we pass? The frigid frost air, it has warmed considerably in recent times. Well, warmed up. I'm still freezing, but. The flow of the frigid air has been disturbed in the forest. Snow has started to melt. Snow is melting, snow that has never melted before. This has never happened even once. Then you appeared in the forest. Is this not your doing? Well, we don't have anything to do with that. It's a coincidence. Please, Akuno, hear me out. It isn't our fault that the snow started to melting here. It's just not, it's not just here. Natural calamites have been pl place are uh, taking place everywhere right now. The forest frigid airflow would have been disturbed even if we c hadn't come. Is that all? You expect me to believe that? Wah! Enough of your foolish talk. Prepare for your end. Stop it. Ooh. Um. Uh, Absol. There is nothing false in what they said. Calamites are indeed occurring in natural disasters. Is that true? Yes. I have the ability to sense natural disasters. The calamites have been taking place now are of a special nature. I've never experienced such before. So there are calamites besides this? Fine. I will choose to believe you. You may pass. Articuno. However, wow! <laughs> you must try to prevent the calamites from spreading. I'm counting on you. Yep, we promise, Articuno. Yeah, we promise! Phew, that was too close. Thank you. You saved us. Rather than saying thanks, focus on stopping the calamites before they will s worsen. If they are unchecked, worse will be for us. My instinct warns me to groan. I sense the terrible power of the natural calamity. I, I was led here by my feelings of foreboding. I think it would be best if we combined forces. I will. Oh, really? What? Oh, that's cool. Huh? You will really? You will really? Really? To put an end to the Academy's cooperation is vital. Let me lend you my powers. Dude, seriously? Are you kidding me? Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Let's call you. Let's call you. Hmm. What could we call you? I don't know. Where's P? Yeah. Poo. End. 
hey, you have a funny name. <laughs> and so, after getting through the frosty forest, Lewis's team headed further north. The, the more they advanced, the harsher the conditions became. Yeah, oh, whatever, I don't care about that. <laughs> The icy mountain path seems to go on forever. We've walked a long way here. Frightful looks exhausted too. We've been running all this time out of desperation. What's in store for us ahead? Are we really doing the right thing? Brrr, this is too cold. There's nothing but snow now. The scenery's been the same for a while. I wonder if we're really making progress. Hey Lewis, I was thinking. I was thinking we've come to a place that's empty except for us. I have this feeling there's nothing ahead of here even if we keep moving. And I'm getting exhausted. We too, what's going to happen to us? Don't worry, we'll be fine. Sure, that's right. There isn't any point in wondering about that might happen, what might happen not after coming this far. Sorry, Lewis. I was just feeling sorry for myself. I have faith in you, Lewis. That's what brought me here. And that's not changing, I still have faith in you, Lewis. I'll keep going wherever you go. Yes. Fightful trusts me without any doubt. I can't afford to be indecisive. I have to believe in myself more. What the hell's going on? You pointing up? Pointing up to the sky! What? What, what was that? D dizzy? Or what? Huh? Is something wrong, Lewis? Finally, finally you have arrived. Someone, someone is talking to me. Frightful, no, this voice isn't frightful. This voice, I've heard it somewhere. It's Gardevoir! Well, you can't really see it. No, it's kind of, you have arrived. Is this finally where we get to finally know our destiny? I've been waiting for you. Ga, Gardevoir! I am so glad. Finally, we get to meet. You are... what? Lewis, is something the matter. Why are you talking to yourself? I cannot be seen by others. I am visible only to you. A little further ahead, there is, ja there is a jagged mountain range topped by Mount Freeze. Inside its peak, Ninetales lives. Ninetales? Ninetales awaits your arrival. Beware. Uh, Wait, what? Oh, ah! Tell us more. Don't go away. Hey, Lewis. Lewis, what's the matter? What happened? Oh, so something like that happened. Gardevoir appeared to you. That's why you were looking so stunned earlier. I am amazing, though. I, I, I am amazing, though. I am amazed, though. Nine Tales isn't that isn't just the legend. It really exists, and what nine and that Nine Tales is up at at the peak. Sniffle, Lewis. All the effort we put into getting here is finally going to bear bear fruit. We'll meet Nine Tales and get the truth. Dude, don't get sentimental on my ass. We finally get rid of the suspicions other others have about you, Lewis. Awesome. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Listen, Lewis, don't be so worried. It will be alright. It's only natural that you would be scared of meeting Ninetales, Lewis, the heartless poke human who abandoned Gardevoir. It may be you. I can understand how you could think that. But that's impossible. You're not that human, I'm sure. You believe in so much in me. Hmm. Well, there was a time when I had some doubts. But now, I wonder why. I really don't know why. But it's alright, Lewis, you're a really good sort. You know before, when I first got the idea to start a rescue team, I met you in the tiny woods, Lewis. Now that I think about it, there was something different about you. It is strange, isn't it? But Lewis, I believe in you. Anyway, we'll, we'll know the truth when we get to the peak. Lewis, let's do our best. Yeah! Let's do this! Let's do this shit! But in the next video, okay? <laughs> In the next episode, we'll be going off into Mount Freeze and doing that dungeon and finding out where Ninetales is, or speaking, going to go and speak to Ninetales. 
So yeah, until then, this is MDM saying thanks for watching, and goodbye.